<laughs> now, you have a very yeah. peculiar uh, party piece. I do. That involves me. I don't know if it's, it's not such a party piece so okay. much. At home at my Rose Selection, I decided to perform something that I do every day that I enjoy. It's the best part of my day. And I was encouraged to share it here. And so I'm going to take you back to your childhood for a small time. Lovely. So um, if we, we can come over here. The audience were wondering what was happening behind. So you're going to read, uh, read me a, a, a bedtime story. Oh, jeez, that's this is great. <laughs> do, do I have a hat? I thought I had a hat somewhere. Oh, you don't need it. You're fine. C could you have got this a bigger like bed, no? Put my specs on. Okay. You're all right. You'll be just, be just fine. I'm not good, lads. We were rehearsing all day. <laughs> you're okay. He's fine there, isn't he? <laughs> now, Dahi, I'm going to read for you The Very Cranky okay. Bear by okay. Nick Bland. Thank you. And you're just fine? Thank you. <laughs> Need some hot milk? <laughs> no. You'll have to ask back okay. there. In the jingle jangle jungle, on a cold and rainy day, four little friends found a perfect place to play. Moose had marvellous antlers and lion a golden mane, and zebra had fantastic stripes, and sheep, well, sheep was plain. Mm -hmm. None of them had noticed that someone else was there. Sleeping in that cave was a very cranky bear. Cranky bear, roar, roar, roar. He gnashed his teeth and stomped his feet and chased them out the door. So in the jingle jangle jungle on a cold and rainy day, four little friends had nowhere warm to play. Wait a minute, said Zebra as she scratched her furry chin. Maybe if we cheered him up, he'd let us come back in. No. Oh. If I did not have stripes, said Zebra, I'd be cranky too. So would I. We should give that bear some stripes, that's what we should do. Okay. Stripes are silly, Moose complained, especially on a bear. My antlers always cheer me oh, up, okay. let's give that bear a pair. No, 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 said Lion. Antlers are a boar, a golden mane like mine, he said, would cheer him up for sure. sure. So Zebra fetched a tin of mud and Lion some grass of gold, and Moose got two big branches and sheep, well, sheep got cold. Oh, poor boys. Sheep was getting worried. They've been eaten up for sure. And then from in the cave, there came a very cranky roar. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is, this is no bedtime story at all. Oh, you'll be fine. Not at all. I was dozing off there now, lads. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our Darwin Rose, Bridget Haynes.